Hi, this is Job for GitLab.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how ridiculously easy it is to install GitLab using GitLab Omnibus. We go to the GitLab Omnibus repository, where we find a link, link to the downloadable packages and the simple steps we have to follow. Here I have a completely clean VPS with Ubuntu prepared, and I'm just going to follow the steps that are listed here. So I can start with OpenSSH. If I manage to copy it. Good, that was already installed. Let's hope the same for postfix, although it shouldn't take long. Also already installed. Good. Now the next step is to, to download the package. So we go to the downloads. The link is also in the repository. Copy link location. Wget. W. Ah, there we go. Now it's downloading the package. Now address is to depackage it. Depackage dash i GitLab. After depackaging, we'll first create a configuration file so we can put our configuration options in there. But in theory, this is not always necessary. Let's, let's, let's create it. Again, the easiest way is to just copy paste the steps. You don't really have to think about it. There we go. And now what we can choose to do is to set the external URL for our GitLab instance. Um, yeah, let's do that. Vim, etc. GitLab, GitLab, RB. External URL. And in this case, it's just a ugly IP address that I've saved here. So I'm going to say HTTP slash slash. There we go. Save this. All right. Now that all that is left to do is to run the GitLab reconfigure. Mind that every time you update the configuration file, you have to run this command again. The first time it will take a while, but the following times it can st skip a bunch of steps and it will be much faster.
All right, the client is done. GitLab is reconfigured. Now we can simply go to the IP. And if everything is correct, ah, look at that. GitLab is working. That's all there is necessary to set up our GitLab instance. Let's log in. Root and a password I always forget. Oh, there we go. Set a new password. Sure, why not remember? And there we go. We have a fully working GitLab instance on our VPS. And we can create projects. It seems like everything is working. So that's all there is to it. Installing GitLab using Omnibus GitLab. It's probably the fastest way to install GitLab at the moment. I hope you enjoyed it.